This episode brought to you by Noble Gold. Check out this free coin offer for my viewers. Noble Gold has thousands of clients who have safely invested with them. Most heard an ad just like this and called the experts. And for the month of March, with a qualified IRA above 20K, you'll get a three ounce silver American virtue coin or a five ounce America the beautiful silver coin for anything over 50K. Call 877-646-5347 now to find out more or visit noblegoldinvestments.com. You can also find the link in the description or pinned comment. Make sure to tell them Drone Tech sent you. Surprise, surprise, we were all right again. So it turns out that that Hunter Biden laptop story that the media, big tech, and the Democrats were so intent on censoring and not talking about just before the 2020 election turned out to be a completely 100% legitimate story. So just add this to the steaming pile of reasons why nobody outside of hardcore Democrats trusts the media anymore. So I'm not gonna spend a bunch of time rehashing the Hunter Biden story. I'm sure plenty of other YouTubers are gonna be doing that. But I do wanna take a step back and just show you the evolution or de-evolution however you want to look at it of the media when it came to the hunter biden laptop story they start out by all claiming in unison that there's no evidence at all that hunter or joe biden did anything wrong and just a quick shout out to the guy i got most of these clips from bill diagustiano from newsbusters make sure to go over there and check out his work i just want to deal in fact because there is so much speculation out there and there is zero evidence that Hunter Biden or Joe Biden did anything wrong here. We should note, again, you, you and I have said this on the air many times, there is no evidence that Joe Biden was you know, involved in any wrongdoing. Of course, I want to note that there is no evidence that Joe Biden or Hunter Biden has done anything wrong. I just want to reiterate. And let's be clear for the viewers. There is no evidence Biden did anything wrong. I'll note again, because it's important. There is no, I repeat, no. There is no evidence that either Biden did anything illegal. There's been no evidence. There was no evidence. There's no evidence. There is no evidence. There is not an iota of evidence. No, no evidence. Biden Biden did did anything anything wrong. Wrong. As that narrative began to crumble, the media adopted the Biden regime's talking points, claiming that it was all just a bunch of Russian disinformation, which just drives me insane every time I think about it, because we now know that the Steele dossier, which they all peddled and spread for years, is verified Russian disinformation. Do you still think that the stories from the fall about your son Hunter were Russian disinformation at a smear campaign, like you said? Yes, yes, yes. The president has said, and you have tweeted, that allegations of wrongdoing based on files pulled from Hunter Biden's laptop are Russian disinformation. There is a new book by a political reporter that finds some of the files on there are genuine. Is the White House still going with Russian disinformation? I think it's broadly known and widely known, Peter, that there was a broad range of Russian disinformation back in 2020. You know what also the United States government says? The FBI says this laptop is not Russian disinformation. So what are you talking about here? This laptop is real. It's not just the laptop. There's other emails. There's text messages. They are real. So okay. according to the Guess U.S. What? government, I the know FBI that you're trying has to verified move this. everybody to look at that, but that's not what we're hearing from Why the FBI. Why don't you want to report but this? What? This is the one of the what? most powerful no, because families Liz, in Washington, Liz, the Liz. Biden family. And you're OK. You're OK with our interest being Liz. sold out to profit. Uh, Liz, Joe Biden and his family when when we're suffering during a pandemic from communist yes, China, he's doing shady business absolutely. deals Liz, with as communist you know China, you're comfortable, well, okay? As, as you know perfectly well, I'm a journalist and a reporter and I follow the facts. And there has never been oh, any sh- issues yes, in terms this. of corruption. Now, let me ask you this. Yesterday, the wait, FBI... Wait, 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 the wait, wait. FBI How do you know and, that? I'm talking about reporting and any evidence. I'm talking to you now... Okay, I would love if you guys would start doing that digging and start doing that verification. No, we're not going to do your work for you. I want to ask you a question. The FBI, it's a journalist's contrary, job. It's a journalist's job to, what to, President... to find out if this is verified. Biden's secret emails. A really fishy story. The Post claimed that the emails were found on a laptop computer that was brought to a repair shop in Delaware in the spring of 2019. The FBI is now investigating whether those alleged Hunter Biden emails are actually connected to a larger foreign intelligence operation. They may be related to a foreign intelligence operation. Foreign intelligence operation. Foreign intelligence. Foreign intelligence. Foreign intelligence operation. For all we know, 
These emails are made up. The information found on the laptop may be part of a Russian disinformation campaign. Part of a Russian uh, disinformation uh, effort. Described by many intelligence experts as having hallmarks. All the hallmark, hallmarks, rather. All the hallmarks of a Russian. Or Russian. Russian disinformation. Russian disinformation. Disinformation campaign. This is a classic example of the right-wing media machine. <laughs> It just goes to prove what I've been saying for several decades now, that you should never trust the Democrat state media because all they do is lie. All right, folks, that's all I have for that one. Smash that like button, share, subscribe, and then leave a comment to let us all know what you think.